Hey guys, I'm Animal Lover and I'm back with another video. Here is part two of my Minecraft series of where I turn the Minecraft mobs into humanoids or humans. Humanish. Whatever it's called. <laughs> whatever they are. I don't know. They're, they're humanish. That, that's what they're called now. So pretty much in this video, I am doing a spider now. So like the common spider. This was randomly picked, I believe, from Fangirl, so thank you, Fangirl, for giving me this randomly. And so, I got the spider, which a lot of us would know of the spider because it's a common mob that we see all the time. We see them in caves, and we see them pretty much outside of the caves, and they're terrifying whenever we see them. And I wanted to do um, um, this one as a female only because of, I probably, I don't think I've actually seen a lot of people do spiders as humans. So I wanted to do it as a female for another part later on in this series of another character. Which I'm not going to say because I don't want to spoil it for you guys. But it is another character, aka another spider. So, just, just so y'all know that that exists in this. So, I'm just gonna shush. But pretty much, I wanted to do a female because I thought it'd be cool. And when I think of spiders, I think of um, females because the females are always scary as heck in, like, the real world. And so, I wanted to incorporate that in this drawing of her being a more of a dominant and kind of more of this, like, um, entrancing person. I don't know. I just wanted to be really creative with her, and I was. I gave her, of course, four arms, and she has two legs. Not the full spider aspect, but what can you do? I don't. I didn't want to do like six arms because that would be hell of annoying. So that's not happening at all. Okay, so my Minecraft experience with spiders. Um, probably the most funniest, aka saddest one I've ever had was I was mining in a cave and everything, and it was like a big pocket kind of like mine area, and I was just mining, mining my own business, and all of a sudden, I'm getting attacked. I'm like, what the fuck? Why am I getting attacked? And I like turn around, and I see this the spider attacking me, and I'm freaking out, and I'm running away, but at the same time, I can't get to my sword quickly, and I'm like still trying to fight the spider, and I end up falling into lava and die. And I lose everything, and I'm sad. I was very sad. It was a very tragic day. But that's what I get for not paying attention. When you mind, pay attention. <laughs> also, if you have a funny experience with spiders or a scary experience with the spiders in Minecraft, leave a comment down below because I would love to see them. I would love to read them. I want to see and read your guys' experiences because I always find them funny because they're always different with everyone. So, yay. Also, if you're wondering why I couldn't get to my sword fast enough, I play on Bedrock and I play on my PlayStation. And so it was really hard. It's always hard for me and Fangirl to like move it fast to get there because we always go the opposite direction and it's really annoying with us personally so say we were like on our like food and we wanted like our sword we will literally go to the other direction to get it and it's the furthest from it so we're always dumb when it comes to that i don't know why we just are do not question us so pretty much with her color palette, I was kind of trying to go with a darker kind of theme. As you can see, why I went like with a blue and everything. I was going to give her red hair, but then I was like, nah, that would be weird. Let's go with more of a grayish, blackish hair. I, I wanted to fit the theme of a spider, kind of, but also make her kind of look darker that's why the blue is in there in her outfit because black can also be seen as blue it, um they do this a lot with anime characters where they give anime characters like um bluish like really dark blue hair to make it seem black it, it's a very interesting thing i don't know how the hell that works it just it does that's what they do and so i wanted to give her blue to make it seem like it's black but we know i know it's not black so do not criticize me on that part so yay also 
if you want uh, merch of this, you can go check out me and Fangirl's Redbubble because I am actually selling my Minecraft drawings as phone cases, prints, and all the other fun stuff. So if you want a drawing of this, go to our Redbubble, maybe go support us on there. That would be really great. We have a whole bunch of other things, not just Minecraft. We have a whole bunch of other prints that you guys can go check out. We got stickers. We have buttons, we have phone cases, pillowcases, all the fun stuff that y'all could ever want. It's great. Like, you can just go check it out, share with people. It would be awesome. Also, if you want to go check out our Patreon to get early access to some stuff and maybe get some exclusive stuff, then it, that's also in our link down below. So, that's great. We also have um, a DeviantArt, we have a Twitter, and we have an Instagram. So if you want to go check out our art there where we post daily, well, at least I post daily, Fangirl, mm, she's very inconsistent. Don't tell her I said that. <laughs> um, but yeah, so pretty much if you want to go check out our stuff, that would be awesome because we got more art to share and more stuff for you all to see. And it would be really great to get more people seeing our stuff because we want a bigger family. Well, I hope you guys enjoy this video. And please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!